Phoebe Tam is an up-and-coming opera singer, one in a wave of fresh talent in Hong Kong looking for places to perform. Opera is something like, oh, it's for the elite. But now, like, more uh, local people are into opera and they're learning as well. These singers are auditioning for a mini production of La Traviata by new company More Than Musical. The aim is to make the shows more approachable. Especially in Europe or if you go to America, opera house, big opera houses are dying. And people always say, oh, you know, opera is just for the elite, for the super rich. Normal people don't understand. Or if you try to get one of your friends who has never been to opera to try to go there, it's like, oh, no, 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 it's not for me. It's very expensive. It's four hours long, and I have no idea what he's talking about. They'll show the operas in the more familiar surroundings of bars and nightclubs. People in Hong Kong have notoriously hectic lifestyles, rushing around, getting many things done in a short time. The organisers of the new mini-opera are hoping that people will welcome a 60 to 90 minute performance rather than the usual three to four hour long one, capturing their attention and keeping it for this new condensed art form. The idea has captured the imagination of the public. Hong Kong people are infamous for their impatience. I think um, this is a huge market, you know, people, um, they would like to try new things especially with a postmodern rap, okay, singing old opera but with new method, small, why not? More than musicals co-founder Rumiko Hasegawa hasn't always been an opera lover. Before discovering singing, she had an intense job as an investment banker. I realize that I've been so busy, I put the lid on my heart and then just so I can keep going and by singing opera, this lid lifted. Sharing the experience of opera by bringing it to the masses in a way that hasn't been done before. Caroline Malone, Al Jazeera, Hong Kong.